why do football referees wear a black string around their hands? Well, it's a lot simpler than you think, but I'm about to tell you much more about that in referees in general than you probably ever wanted to know. First off, football officials are commonly but incorrectly referred to as referees. Each position has a specific duty and specific name. The referee, the umpire, the headlinesman, or the down judge, the line judge, back judge, side judge, center judge, and field judge, or the head referee. I'll go ahead and answer the first question. What is the thing that's on the referee's hand? Well, it's actually a down counter. It's a specifically designed wristband that is used to remind officials of the current down. It has an elastic loop attached to it and is wrapped around the fingers. Usually officials put the loop around their index finger when it is first down, the middle finger when it is second down, and so on. Instead of the custom designed indicator, some officials use two thick rubber bands tied together as a down indicator. You won't see that in the NFL, I promise you. You have probably noticed that there are multiple referees using down indicators, however they're not all used for indicating the down. Some are used for indicating the yard line it is on and others are used for indicating where the ball is placed within the, within the field, whether it be the right hash, the left hash, or the middle of the field. NFL officials will also carry bean bags that are used to mark spots that are not fouls but which may be possible spots of penalty enforcement or illegal touching of a scrimmage kick. For example, a beanbag is used to mark the spot of a fumble or the spot where a player called a punt. It is typically colored white, blue, black, or orange depending on the official's league they're playing in. In the NFL, they are black, white, and blue. There's no orange beanbag. Now, there are multiple different beanbags, but I'm not going to cover each one because that would simply take too long. So, on to the next piece of equipment. The penalty marker is a bright yellow colored flag that is thrown on the field toward or at the spot of a foul. For fouls where the spot is unimportant, such as fouls which occur at the snap or during a dead ball, the flag is thrown vertically down. The flag is wrapped around a weight, such as sand or beans, or occasionally ball bearings, although this has been discouraged since an incident in an NFL game demonstrated that those could injure players. There are weights in the penalty flag so that a ref can throw it further and so that wind won't move the placement of the flag. If an official runs out of flags because he's throwing them all, then he also might drop a hat instead. There's also other uses for the hat, but I will cover that in another video. Similar to the down indicator, the yard line indicator is used to keep up with placement of the ball. Now, this is not really used in the NFL because they have seven refs and know where the ball is going to be. However, it's used often in smaller leagues like high school and below because there's only three or four refs on the field instead of seven. And that will do it for this video. Tap on any of the videos on your screen right now if you are interested. But until next time, hopefully I will see you in the next video. Thank you for watching.